everyone i hope you all are having a lovely start to your week or whenever you watch this morning night whenever it is i am going to be filming a what i eat in a week kind of video hang on so sorry for looking like a complete fetus but i'm going to be filming a what i eat in a week video it's monday today it is 8 41 a.m and i've already started my day with my smoothie which i have just finished over here by the way you guys can get these cups from well tumbler whatever you want to call it from kmart but i've finished my um my smoothie we're going to be very very busy mondays are very busy for ned and i we're always on the go because he has his meetings and i usually follow him around but today we're going to be out the entire day so i prepped all of our food and i'll quickly show you guys that but throughout this video i'm just going to show you my breakfast lunch snacks and dinners and post-workout meals pre-workout meals or whatever i eat whatever literally i put into my mouth so you guys can have a little bit of meal ideas or health by your life because i mainly eat healthy in this in my life but let's get started with my meal prep for today's uh, breakfast well I have my breakfast but lunch and snacks so for my breakfast media I just have like a serving of the collagen um, dairy-free caramel creamer by dose and co and then I have started putting like a little dollop of this in it and then I'll just put a serving of the fit protein the cookie dough free protein by Tropica and some like maybe 300 mils of almond milk and then blend it up and that is it that's my breakfast done but for some lunch i've prepped up literally a whole bag we did a little bit of grocery shopping last night and i also have some boiled chicken for tonight that i'm gonna marinate um in a sauce and make some stir fry with that but let me show you what i have for lunch okay so i've now put some baby spinach some chicken sausages and some pasta um this is just like a mediterranean napolitan kind of pasta from the frozen section from Woolworths. Um, picked that up and got that ready. Ned has a protein yogurt and some nuts for a snack. And he's also got a salad over there. I'll be dressing mine with either sriracha mayo that I've got ready myself or um, just the like normal sriracha. And for Ned's salad, we have a Mexican salad dressing. And then for a snack for Ned, we have the beggar string cheeses and also a keto bar and for myself i just have a low carb bar by um, body science i love these ones i got them literally from um chrissy Spalding's recommendations and like freaking hell are they good Alrighty, there's it's morning there's a lot of cars going by but i will definitely see you guys for either my snack or my lunch just a little update i made a vanilla ice latte i used some sugar i used um obviously instant coffee and also um vanilla almond milk for this one but this is going to be for on the go for me this is what on the go lunch looks like oh and it goes and gets me a whole pack of tissue we're at my mother-in-law's but because we're on the go today we have to go visit a few people this is going to be a little snack it's just the bsc bar the body science bar like i said this morning um and yeah this is going to be my little snack i'll see you guys for either my second snack or my din din so as you guys saw, dinner was just barramundi and some veg with the, with my mother-in-law and everything. But I'm going to get um, dinner ready for tomorrow because we're going to be out all day. I'm just basically going to do a chicken and um, veg kind of lemon pepper seasoned stir fry. And I'm thinking of just a side salad or maybe some boiled potatoes or boiled sweet potatoes next to it. But let me show you my ingredients. So this is the little prep. Yeah, 300 grams of chicken, 300 grams of veg. This is the seasoning that I'm going to use. I'm just keeping it very basic and simple for um, my gut reasons because I just like basic ingredients and my gut's been thriving off that. And yeah, I chopped my finger. How sad. And then I'm going to also be using a tablespoon of Nutlex as well. So just a tablespoon of Natalix, fry it all in there, but first I'm going to defrost my veggies in the pan and then add my Natalix later on. I'm also going to be adding two tablespoons of the pot, so I'm going to get a cream in it. 
And I decided to put 400 grams of chicken, my cooked chicken breast. Once your veggies seem to be cooked, give that a stir and then add your nuttolets in there so they can fry. Alright, so when your chicken kind of browns like that one we've got over here, you want to add in your herbs and spices, maybe just a dollop of water as well, and then um, also um, your ricotta. So roughly, I'm adding about that much of water to stop it from burning. And then we're gonna add in the lemon pepper seasoning. We wanna season that really well. So that was roughly 15 grams of the seasoning. Give that a good stir so that can all coat together. One a full tablespoon. We'll do three tablespoons. And another dollop of water. And that's it. Milk pitch easily done but I'll show you guys my lunch. We've got um, this is just like meal prep that I've made just 30 grams of spinach 200 grams of potatoes peas corn and broccoli and then 100 grams of uh, chicken and I'll also have um, uh, some sriracha mayo with it and then I'm taking along a Rocky Road Body Science Bar. You guys will definitely see me chomp this down later on during the day. I'm having a cheeky vanilla collagen coffee. I've got 20 grams of collagen in there, some sugar and some espresso. I'm going to add my boiling water and then this is like a little half my sister taught me. I'm going to add some vanilla almond milk with ice and I'll show you guys how it ends up being. But I have like collagen twice a day. This is my second bottle of this. I tried the caramel as well this one's bloody amazing i absolutely love it and i've been seeing the benefits in my skin especially it's glowing literally and i don't have flaky skin anymore on my legs and underneath my arms and everything and i gross but like we're all guilty but yeah if you guys have like a bullies or a coals nearby i highly 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 recommend it like stock up on it. it's really good stuff Alrighty, that's how it turns out it's literally that amazing oh, love this angle but i'll have this also have some um, ice cream later on. If you guys have a cold, go and buy it. I'm watching my Turkish soap operas and also editing over there. But I stopped for a little bit of a Halo Top cocktail. So I like to have the Halo Top ice creams with like either peanut butter or the panna, peanut butter caramel or chocolate hazelnut spreads. And I literally rub it. Put it in there, let that freeze, and use it as a topping. I'll see you guys in the morning. <laughs> wow, wow, we look like a complete freak. All right, good morning, everyone. We're having our breakfast smoothie. Same thing as yesterday. They still haven't come out of the cage yet, so. Be a shit show. I've just uploaded my stories onto Instagram and I'm going to get ready for my day. I'll put on my makeup and everything. Just say a little bit of a hello. I think I'm going to also put a little bit of makeup on today because I don't feel quite good. Like I feel quite down. I'm taking my laptop with me to do a little bit of work on the way there and to and from as well because my life is literally so busy and I don't have time to do it. And then I find myself editing at 12 a.m. in the morning with my laptop in bed. So yeah, breakfast smoothie with coffee in there and the vanilla that I showed you guys last night. But I'll see you guys at lunch. Now we're in the car, he's having his nuts. And I'm having my milk We are just picking up our car from the mechanic. We're picking up the car that oh, I drive from the mechanic, but I thought I'd give you guys a little update. We're gonna go home and I'm going to probably like play around with the dogs, have a little snack, and then at night time we're gonna go to the gym. But yeah, I thought I'd pop in, give you guys a little update. I really don't know how these, what I eat in a week kind of work. Like, do you only want to see the food? Do you want to see a bit of my day as well? I don't know. I might pop in some videos from the gym as well. But yeah, that was my little update. I'll see you guys a little bit later. I had an ice latte, a vanilla ice latte. I'm going to refrigerate that so I can have it um, after we come back from the gym. But I'm having like a pre-dinner, pre-gym kind of snack. We'll probably go in the next two hours, so this will like easily digest. It won't make me feel sick. 
It's light, super simple, and it's freaking chicken, which I absolutely love. I used to do this when I was younger. Get sliced cheese. You and then like the sliced cheese? I'm not having it yet. We're gonna leave though, or else I would have tried it. So, exactly like that. So because I'm a mayo fanatic, I'm gonna put some mayo on it. It's 8.30, we've just had a bit of a kerfuffle um, of a day. Sorry, I'm just changing rooms. Um, but the brown puppy that I had, Abby's babies, got sold. We can't go to the gym because Ned's too tired. He's gone to see his friend and it's like 8.30 and we haven't had dinner yet. So I'm gonna do a little bit of an ab and kind of like booty workout right in my room. And I thought I'll show you guys, I'm literally in my page. I'm not going to even bother to change why are the dogs here. But yeah, I thought I'd update you guys on that and enjoy my little home makeshift workout. Good luck to me. This is literally just to engage my abs and contract my glutes. So it's not a workout. Change your plans, I'm having a toasty for dinner. I'm actually having two, and Ned's having some chicken sausages and a little bit of the food that I cooked yesterday. So I microwave all of that. I'm just gonna have it watching a movie over there. Oh, hi. <laughs> Sorry. Hi guys, um, I know that I am probably the worst YouTuber ever, but or vlogger ever, but it's Wednesday and it is 3 p.m. and I have put my um my what I ate today up on my Instagram, but I forgot to completely vlog. I've never done this before, I've never forgotten to vlog, but today was just one of those days where it was really busy and I had to do a lot of content. So I'm gonna pop in in the next slide a couple of videos that I, um, that I, um, what's the word? That I put on my Instagram stories of what I ate and everything till now and then I will remember to vlog for the rest of the day I promise I am so sorry for this but you're gonna get iPhone quality content well, I'll show you what I got um what are you doing biting her like that I've got 150 grams of uh, shredded chicken that I defrosted and then I've got um, 73 grams of broccolini and I think 166 grams of um, my carbs which is the boiled sweet potato and your girl is having we're having a nice coffee i forgot to record it when i was doing it but it's a dos and co vanilla collagen iced latte with almond milk Alrighty, the time is now 3.30, well coming to 3.30. I just did a mini ab workout. Ned and I are going to go to the gym tonight. But still, I wanted to just engage my abs a little bit before the gym because, um, what do you call it? I didn't, we didn't end up going to the gym for like two, three days straight. So I think I'm going to have, I think I'm going to have two cans of tuna. Alrighty, I'm going to have two cans of tuna just before the gym. Well, he's still got like one and a half hours to come home. It's just the oven dried tomato and basil tuna by John West. Let me get this prepared. Oh, and I also like steamed some more broccolini because I absolutely loved it today. So I just steamed a little bit more for the rest of the week and for dinners and everything. So I'm going to be incorporating that into my diet this week. I know some people hate tuna, but like, how could you honestly hate this? Like how? Oh my gosh, golly gosh. And what I'm gonna do is first log this into my finish pal. And then on top of that, your girl is gonna add a little bit, when I say a little bit, I mean a lot of salt. I just need to have it with plain salt for a sec. Mm. If 
you're awoke, you'll understand. And with these two on top, delish. Mm -mm. And I'll take this with me. Time to edit. So Wednesday night dinner is the chicken ricotta veggies that I made and then next to it I just put a side of shredded lettuce and we're going to have some sriracha and some mayo on that but it smells so good. Time to watch my Turkish soap operas. It's full of drama this thing and have dinner with my hubby. Good morning, it's another day. It is now Thursday. I'm gonna go shopping today, but I am preparing dinner from now. You guys know, you guys get the drill. I like doing this every single day. Well, every single day that I make dinner because I just don't need to think about it then and it's ready when we come home. But let me show you what we're making. By the way, I am halfway through having my smoothie, my collagen and Tropica cookie dough smoothie. And I'll get lunch ready in a little bit, but we've got a whole ordeal of din dins. So dinner is all done, and now I'll show you my lunch before I heat it up, because I'm going to take it on the go with me. But we've just got last night's dinner with um, some lettuce. I'm just using up whatever I have in the fridge, so this is going to be lunch on the go. I am literally the worst vlogger. I am sorry, but I just bought a um, ice latte from Starbucks, waiting for my appointment at laser clinic so i thought i'd pop in and show you guys what i'm drinking it's an ice latte with caramel in it and half a shot of coffee That workout was a killer. My legs are jelly, my abs are gone. I'm done, I'm done. I need some protein. I honestly need some protein. This is how simple I get. Literally having chicken slices for a post-workout snack. I alternate between my bars and protein snacks like this. And I'm that basic that I'm actually gonna put sriracha on this and eat it like that. But this is my snack for today while I edit. So you like din dins. And here is dinner. We've got the food that I made from today and then we have lettuce, some garlic aioli and some guacamole with some salsa. Oh, and Ned is going to have these as well. So he'll be having them like little, little tacos. Nachos, sorry. Good morning everyone, happy Friday. We've got only tomorrow left for this video to hang in there. But I've just gotten my lunch ready, I've gotten ready as well. I thought I'd give you guys a little OOTD because I look quite cute. Sorry if I have chicken in my mouth. I'm just snacking on my, my lunch. But let me quickly show you my outfit and show you guys what I've made for lunch. Okay, we've got this set from Kmart on. I legitimately bought this from Kmart. Why aren't I in focus? There we go. But it was $10 for the pants, $15 for the top. So like what, $25 and then shoes from Big W. My glasses are from Oscar Wiley. All of the jewelry that I have on is from uh, Just Hand Collection. You guys can use the code NAT10 at the checkouts for 10% off your order. They come in all different kinds of materials like silver, gold, nine karat gold, 14 karat gold, rose gold. And then the watch band is from Case to Fly. Again, the Just Hand Collection. But this is the OOTD for today. Anyway, let me go show you my lunch. So I got to my lunch prepared from last night. Sorry about the construction going on outside, but it's basically 100 grams of lettuce, 224 grams of sweet potato, and 100 grams of chicken. And this is what that bound boy looks like. We're gonna heat this up and get going. Alrighty, I have done all of my errands that I need to outside, and now I'm just gonna do a quick arm workout because I've got my laser appointment at 3.40, and Ned and I need to take uh, Milo out to the park when he comes back from work because he needs big D shedding. So we're gonna, instead of probably going to the gym today, we're gonna just take the dog out to a walk and probably just chill at the park, let him play around and everything. I'm not sure if we're gonna take all the dogs, so I thought I'll do. 
at, at an at-home arm and back workout. Very simple, very chill. Gonna only take half an hour. It's two, two o'clock almost now, I think. Yeah, one one fifty, almost two o'clock, and I thought half an hour of this, take my makeup off and go to laser. Whew. All right, my battery's low, so I've got to change the battery. But so I'm gonna wipe my face off and scoff down a protein bar. The one that I'm gonna have is by BSC Body Science, and it's their Rocky Road flavor. But I'll most likely have it in the car. Um, I can't find it now. Just this one here. It's essential to get your protein in after your workout. Um, which I had my cards before and now I'm gonna have my protein. I'll see you guys very soon. And this is tonight's dinner. The food that I cooked yesterday, I still have like a whole tub of it left in the fridge, but I'll have it for lunch um, this week. And some lettuce. And Ned's having some um, keto bread with aioli. Good morning, everyone. I'm doing all afternoon. I'm in the middle of filming, but I completely forgot to show you guys my Saturday's food. Today's the last day of this vlog, but sorry about my little cracks over here. We are trying to heal them. But for breakfast, I made these protein oats as you guys saw last night, and I made an extra three um, for the next week because I absolutely loved it. But I had this bad boy over here. And then for my lunch right now, while I'm exporting some files onto my camera, I am just having some sweet potatoes, chicken and lettuce. I couldn't hold myself, I got so hungry. And we're gonna be snacking on that while I do the exporting of my, my files. And then I'm at the moment cooking dinner. I'm editing this video, but I just finished my workout, had my shower, took my tan off, made myself look a little bit more presentable. I'm gonna have my post-workout snack. But basically, I'm just going to have some chicken loaves because, like, protein, you know. So I will be having the chicken loaf but with a little bit of ricotta cheese and some mayo. The last dinner of this week, so what I eat in a day, it's going to be the pasta that I made from today. It's like cognac noodle spaghetti with chicken and some spicy. I did not know how hard it can be filming every single thing you put in your mouth for a whole week. Honestly, this video literally took its toll on me. But that's going to be the end of today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope it gave you a little bit of meal inspo and whatnot. If you guys are new here, I'd love it if you guys can stick around. And if you guys aren't new and just a returning subscriber and are here till the very end of the video, thank you so much for watching. I love you and your support. But anyway, if you guys like this video, please don't forget to give it a like. Don't forget to share it with your friends and family. And also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button because I now upload every single three days. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next couple of days with a new video. Bye!